like you hurt me too today's what I eat in a day started I've been loving to have air fryer potatoes like for uh, my breakfast in the morning so I usually do about two potatoes and um, one and a half was just enough today so I think I had a little bit of a bigger potato today so I will let you guys know the points at the end but this is you uh, genuinely how I make them so these are the seasonings I like to use I like to use the Trader Joe's chili lime seasoning and just sprinkle that on there a generous amount because we like things seasoned around here and then I like to use Lari's seasoned salt I put this on all of my like fries and potatoes that I make and it's pretty salty so make sure you don't add any more salt <laughs> and then I'm gonna use a Mrs. Dash garlic and herb salt free seasoning I want the garlic taste without the salt so this is a good way to go. I season everything really generous, generously. Oh, this is not the lid. So while I'm cooking this potatoes, I'm just making a Morning Star veggie, veggie sausage. You guys know I love these. They're one point per sausage. I was thinking about having two, but I'm not going to. <laughs> so um, yeah, I love these. You can get them really crispy in the pan and they taste it just like sausage. Mom, so yeah. Mom, yeah, baby. What's that? These have work. So yeah. Yeah, good morning, you guys. I haven't really talked to you this morning because I look like this. I have on like full on pajamas today, like a pajama set, and my hair just looks crazy, but that's the normal around here. Um, but yeah, hopefully I will get ready at some point, but not right now. So yeah, basically what I wanted to say is when you're making these potatoes, make sure you're take, taking them out like every couple of minutes and shaking them around to evenly get them um, cooked. Also, just watch them because I do mine at 390 for 15 minutes, but it doesn't really take 15 minutes. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to throw that in there if you decide to make these. They're super good. Um, obviously, everybody's had potatoes before, but it's just a great, um, what do you call it? What the heck did I just, oh, I swear I just saw a squirrel jump from like a tree to the, I don't know. 
anyway um what was i saying it's such a like um what do you call when you like need a meal that's like hearty and like yeah it's just a good meal like for when you're craving something like hearty and good so that's what i'm making this morning um i got my sausage cooking and i'm gonna go ahead and make my coffee it's gonna be decaf because that's all the instant coffee i had and i want a whipped coffee but it is what it is <laughs> You hurt me too positive i forgot to show y'all my breakfast after sitting there and filming me making the whole thing what the heck but i have a picture of it so i'll throw it up right here um so the potatoes were four points for that serving um i did in my app one and a half medium rest of potatoes because they weren't small but they weren't like a large rest of potato so i did one and a half and i and then i did two servings so me and gabriel but he's only going to eat half of a serving so um it ended up being four points so it was pretty filling and then the veggie sausages i did not eat because i burnt it so i'm gonna go ahead and delete that from my app but yeah i'm about to get my first 20 ounces of water in still gotta finish a little bit of coconut milk um coffee i made and by the way if you've never used coconut milk it is so good Ugh, it's so yummy I just have a thing for coconut so yeah that is basically it that coffee ended up being one point for the coconut milk and that was it and then the breakfast was four so so far i've used five points today and yeah i'm gonna let my camera charge because it's dying so there's something on my face now but i will update you guys later i want to make this video kind of like a vlog slash what i eat in a day um because i usually i sometimes do them separate but Sometimes I like to do them together. It's just whatever I'm feeling. So, yeah, I'm gonna let you guys charge on the charger and I'll update you later. Hopefully I'll look better, but I don't promise anything. Hey, so it's been a little while later um, and I just got ready. I'm still wearing pajamas. I'm still wearing pajamas, just a better form of them. 
lounge clothes, if you will say. Um, some days I feel like getting ready, some days I don't. Mainly the days after the day that I got ready, so that makes sense. But I'm on my fourth water for today, so almost 100 ounces, so I'm pretty proud of that. Um, and after I finish this, I'm probably going to make some lunch. I ate like two hours ago, but I'm getting hungry. And I can't stop like looking at stuff online. Like, I don't know if it's just the boredom, like telling me to like online shop, but it's just not good. And I'm just trying not to buy anything. I bought um, Joanna Gaines second cookbook on Amazon last night. I loved the first one. That's partly why I'm fat is because I used to make everything out of that cookbook um like everything that i now make homemade is her recipes that i now call my recipes because i love them that much like i've adapted them and now i just know them by heart like her chocolate chip cookies her banana bread her biscuits and gravy just like a ton of different foods that i've adapted and like literally they're so good so i'm super excited i pre-ordered it so it should get here like today or tomorrow um so yeah even though i'm on ww but i'm definitely gonna be cooking some stuff out of her um cookbook if i do it like every week or something i loved what baby huh what are you talking about I loved everything in her first cookbook, so I'm excited about that, but um, that's basically it. I've done a little bit of cleaning today. Um, I don't have much to do. Like, I do my dishes at night, and my living room is pretty much picked up right now. I'll probably have to clean it at the end of the day. I just made my face... Oh my god, my eye looks so swollen. It's been so itchy today. Tell me that does not look swollen, you guys, compared to this one. It's been like so itchy today, I don't know what's going on. But anyway, ignore my swollen eye. Um, so I ordered some, I also want to order some um, conditioner and stuff because I'm out and Zach doesn't really want to go in the store because he doesn't have masks. So we're trying to like limit how many times he goes to the store. So I am probably gonna order some conditioner and stuff from Target and I was also looking at their BB creams because for days like this that I don't feel like getting ready, but I want to put something on my face um, that's not, like, super heavy and, like, yeah, so I was looking at a BB cream, which I might get, um, and I just don't want to spend any more money, but it's, like, I have nothing else to do. Uh, anyway. I'm gonna finish my water, but I'll update you guys whenever I make some. Alright guys, this is my lunch for today. It's like been my favorite combo ever. I know it looks kind of crazy, but this is like my favorite thing ever to have for lunch recently. Um, so I just have about an ounce of this Prima Della buffalo chicken. It's my favorite. You get it from the deli at Walmart. Um, on two pieces of my favorite bread. It's the Sara Lee butter bread. It's so soft and good you guys so worth the points and then 24 bite-sized Tostitos of four points. So I have that four tablespoons of the Fritos jalapeno cheddar dip I will show you in a second because I put it in the fridge um, a little bit of salsa and then jalapenos because I just like to eat it like that and then this is what I put on my sandwich is a tablespoon of light mayo for a point and mustard for zero and so I'm gonna go get that cheese dip cheese dip just the jalapeno cheddar it's super good on points and it makes me feel like I'm eating like maybe theater nachos or something it's just so good so that has been my combo of choice lately for lunch it ends up being like 13 points for everything so yeah I am gonna go enjoy my lunch. I'm actually going to get some water, but put a little water flavoring packet. I'll show you the ones I'm using right now. And yes, we have another bag of those just in case I run out. Um, but this is the kind I love right now. It has caffeine in it, and I haven't had any caffeine today um, since I used decaf coffee. So I'm gonna have one of these little babies. They're so good. And the flavor wild strawberry. So yeah, I'm just gonna get my drink made up and then we are going to eat. So tonight we're going to be having KFC bowls. I'm sure everyone knows how to make these because they're like a, I would say like a staple WW recipe. It's like one of the first things I learned to make when I started WW. 
but um, I've never tried it with the Trader Joe's mashed potatoes because we don't have a Trader Joe's near us. So I got these a while ago and they're like super good on points. I believe you can have like eight of the pieces for like a couple of points. But instead of doing shake and bake chicken, I think I'm just going to use up these chicken bites that we buy from Sam's Club um, just so I can use them up and get room in my freezer. And then you're going to need this home style chicken gravy. Excuse me, I had to clear my throat. Um, Fat-free cheese, and then a can of corn, and that's literally it. So I'm gonna be filming this for my what I eat in a day tonight, but this is also gonna be in a upcoming what I eat for dinner video. I'm filming like my week of dinner, so if you see this twice, I'm sorry, but so I'm gonna go ahead and start these in the um, pan because that's how they cook, and then I'm gonna throw these in the air fryer and put the corn on the stove as well. So, that's it. I can hurt you like you hurt me too. basically the bowl um, it is 10 points for all of this and once I mix it together the cheese will melt a lot better but it's so good I'm so excited to eat I have to finish making theirs and I have stacks of mashed potatoes cooking I need to be turned down um, I think they're ready actually so yeah we are gonna eat now all right, so I'm trying one of these opal, they're called opal apples, um, and they're like yellow, and I put some sugar-free caramel sauce for one point, um, and I'm going to try them out for dessert tonight. They are very sweet, Zach. Huh? They are very sweet. I'm very good. Anyways, I'm going to finish my apples. I think that's all I'm going to have tonight, so I'm going to end this video right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Trying to finish training. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like what I eat today, don't forget to like this video. It really, really helps my channel out. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.